up everybody? Right now I'm in the midst of making Mike's holster. Mike is actually, uh, I don't know if I mentioned last night. Yeah, I did. How we uh, ground down the wrong post on my gearbox. He's on his way. He found a gearbox shell uh, locally. So he's on his way to go pick it up right now. And I'm, uh, I'm going to make his holster. So funny knife. Funny enough, Mike was, uh, Mike was in Alphonse's uh, latest video. So I just thought it was funny. But uh, yeah, let's make this holster before it fucking melts. Oh, we just heard an accident. So, I so. I was like, oh, it was just a motorcycle that wanted to be very aggressively loud and backfire. So we just went to Harbor Freight because Nina found they had heat guns on super sale. So I got we got a heat gun for eight dollars. Eight dollars. Hair dryers are more expensive. Fuck yeah, they are. So uh, we got that. And I am probably gonna go there tomorrow and get a scroll saw because uh, hella cheap. Everything's cheap as fuck there. So, uh, but now we're on our way to to Wally World. And uh, oh, while we were while we were in uh, at Harbor Freight, there was just two Hellcats and a Scat Pack that were just sitting there along with my car. So it was pretty cool. So, <laughs> what was it? Uh, Destroyer Gray Hellcat Charger Go Mango challenger wide body hellcat and a plum crazy and another there's a scat pack and um, a go mango charger and then of course my b5 blue charger so you had all the best colors there is except hell reason all right so we're home we actually went and picked up oh shit hold up this is copyrighted fuck okay um we went and picked up uh bill's uh jackram scatter gun the uh the super shorty and i'm gonna go ahead and make a uh, retention clamp holster thing for it pretty much it's gonna be a holster and uh speaking of holsters i finished mike's left-handed uh glock 19x holster really it's a, a universal glock holster because of the uh molded section so really it should fit any glock speaking of that just to prove it whoa i'm gonna put nina's in it so, obviously, like I said, molded for a Glock 19X, and it is a Glock 23. It should hypothetically fit in it, and it does. So, that was the magazine. That was the magazine. God damn it. It's got a really sensitive button. Yeah, it fits in it. It's got adjustable retention. That's what that screw is for. Uh, just made some Kydex clips for it for belt loops. Yep, that definitely needs to be uh, loosened up. Oh, wait, you know what? Oh, yeah, it will. Left-handed, because it's got the pull-auto fun button. And, uh, you know, as long as it's not a Glock 18, which if you're wearing it left-handed, you'd be fine. Um, it's got the full sweat guard on it. And I, the only thing I got to do to this is sand it real quick. Uh, do a quick sanding, and it'll be done. Yeah, so it'll fit any Glock. So, you know, just happened to be this one. I'm good. I don't want a Starburst. I don't want a Starburst. I don't want it. We're not sponsored. So, uh, yeah. Yep. It's all, all done. And, yeah, it's good to go. So, now, like I said, I'm going to sand this up. And then I'm going to go ahead and start working on the, the scatter, the super shorty and see how that'll turn out that's uh entirely experimental so we'll see and i'm hoping to make a cool dual wheel uh single double holster for double 19 or bitch these ain't 19 11s desert eagles so and behind the back like cross draw so you have you know pull out two out of your ass so uh yeah we're gonna have fun with it so it's complete. First holster. Very happy with it. I'm uh, definitely going to need to get some uh, some actual like uh, from the factory clips made because um, you know these aren't the cleanest, but they work. Especially since I'm using all hand tools, so I'm uh, pretty impressed. So hopefully here soon I'm going to get some uh, some actual machinery and get this stuff done. So let's uh, throw some Kydex in the oven. Throw the gun in the press. All right, so 
I tried making a holster uh, for this, the super shorty, and <laughs> I was pretty much done with it, other than the fact that it just didn't hold very well, which it was a, a taco style, but it was, I was trying to get it to where you can literally just like slide it in like from the side or, you know, and it'll lock right in. But sadly, it didn't work the way I was hoping. So this is uh, pretty much scrap. I already drilled holes into it. So, I mean, I can obviously always repurpose it into something. But um, I uh, accidentally made it left-handed. So I'm pretty sure Phil needed it right-handed. So I screwed that up. And uh, I'm just going to go ahead and make it a traditional style holster. So it might have to end up being like a leg holster due to the fact that the shotgun is so long. I mean, even though it's a super shorty, it's not your average pistol length is uh, what I mean. So we will definitely figure that out. And I'm going to do that uh, tomorrow just because it was, uh, you know, kind of gave up on it for the night. Anyways, it's, it's midnight. But uh, I had another small project my sister Brianna wanted me to do. And here it is. It is a little lighter holder necklace. So and I, it's uh, wrapped with paracord. It's a paracord necklace. And I've got a little retention thing. So you can adjust the, the retention on it. So but yeah, it's, I mean, super light. Need your lighter, makes a little funny pop slide it right back in slides it right back in all great all graceful all I said all graceful boom so I might uh, take the heat gun really quick and bevel that out just a little bit that way it, it is easier to get in one handed but you know Knotted it so the it doesn't come undone. Obviously, kill yourself with it if you want. Don't condone it. <laughs> no, don't do that. But uh, yeah, it's uh, pretty cool. So you got an adjustable length if it's too long, you know, too low. Personally, that's perfect for me. And um, you know, but I don't need a lighter really, so I don't smoke. I hit this fucking thing. But, uh, yeah, so it turned out really cool. I'm, uh, I'm happy with it. And we got the left-handed Glock, Glock holster with a full, um, sweat guard. And, yeah, everything, it's, it's all done. So, very happy, I'm very happy with this, how this turned out. I still actually need to sand it and, uh. You know, just on the, around the edges and the perimeter and everything, just to uh, get all the little tiny burrs and smooth it out. As you can see, it's kind of got some funky lines, but uh, we'll pile it, you know, buff those out. Works great. I'm super happy with it, Mike. Glad you like it, man. And uh, you know, it took me a while, but hey, you know, I don't mind. So, just uh, I gotta make him a. Uh, a mag carrier and uh, you know I, I made this really quick so it was just a, a little piece of scrap kydex you know obviously it could be used for anything but uh you know figure why not make it into that she wanted one my sister requested it so but anyways guys that's it for today we're gonna go to bed Nina's already passed out on the couch so we'll see you guys tomorrow